Hi, my name is Taylor Jones, and I'm the chief memory creator of DeerPhotograph.com. So everything started for me May 25th, 2011, when I was looking through an old photo album with my family after a dinner one night, and I came across a photo of my younger brother Landon, who was in the exact same spot that he was in the photo that, that he was that night uh, during dinner. I took the photo out of the photo album, and I held it up and lined up the cabinets and the fridge and everything, and I thought I'm going to grab my camera and take a photo of this. So I lined it all up, took a photo of it, and then I took around seven more from around the house that were in the photo album, and I uploaded them onto a Tumblr after that it kind of took off a bit. It hit the front page of Reddit, which is why it got a quarter of a million hits. And that's when really all the press started happening. It was ABC, World News Person of the Week, Time Magazine named me number 11 website of 2011. To date right now, the blog has around 30 million hits. So from all of the success that Deer Photograph has had, it's given me a lot of opportunity to be able to do a lot of different things. Uh, I was invited to the Festival des Images in Vevey, Switzerland in September 2012, where lots of artists and photographers are invited to show their work and their art's all over the city. And mine was in the abandoned warehouse where I had, uh, I think, about 100 photographs on a wall where I could actually see people interact with the photos, which was a lot different than seeing or not seeing people interact with the photos when they're on their computer. And uh, it was just a really cool thing for me to do, to go to a different country and and have my, my art up on the walls. I also uh, got contacted by Universal Pictures this past year. We teamed up with them for a new movie ca that came out called About Time, starring Rachel McAdams and Dom Hill Gleason. It was directed by Richard Curtis, who is a very well-known director. So we did uh, a contest with them where we people could send in their photos about love or about family, because that's really what the movie was all about. Once they did that, we awarded them the winner, what we thought was the best one, uh, with a trip to anywhere in the world and for them to go make their own memories. This whole, this whole project has been really rewarding for me because I've seen a lot of pretty cool things happen out of it. So a lot of the photos uh, are pretty popular just based off of the mix of having some of its emotional connection to people and uh, the nostalgic factor of it. Uh, there's one in particular that has been shared, um, Just it just has reached over 900,000 notes on Tumblr, which is likes and reblogs. And it's a photo of one of the 9-11 towers um, on fire. It's kind of hard to explain, um, but it's a very touching photo and a lot of emotion comes out of it. And also a lot of people have shared it. Kim Kardashian, Rihanna, and Ryan Seacrest have posted on their Facebooks, their their Instagrams and everything. And so it's become quite uh, the well-known photo online around September 11th, I guess. And uh, usually when we share it, people uh, react to it a lot differently based off of their emotion that they get out of it. And uh, I think around this, this year, it'll probably hit a million uh, notes on it. So it's pretty sad, um, but it's just one of those photos that you can look at and you can really kind of feel like you were you were there again and you can remember where you were that day. So we are looking at making a second Deer Photograph book. If anyone's at all interested, you're more than welcome to submit a photo. You can go to DeerPhotograph.com slash submission. You can also follow us on Twitter, which is at Deer Photograph, Instagram, which is the same, at Deer Photograph, and Facebook.com slash Deer Photograph. And we post a photo every single day, um, so we'd love to see your photo up there.